to my channel. If this is the first time you're here, then hi, my name is Stephanie, and today I am so excited for this unboxing because I have eight budget-friendly subscription boxes. All the boxes that I'm going to be opening today are $15 and under. I like all types of of subscription boxes but I love them when they are budget friendly so I hope that they are good every single one of them that I got this is the first time that I'm getting these boxes so we are going to be opening them together so here I hope they don't all topple over I have a feeling they will I tried to stack them up but here is my stack <laughs> of boxes. Um, so I am going to kind of cut them all open to save on time and then we are going to get inside of all of them. So uh, I'm going to try to get through it kind of quickly, not go into a ton of detail, just kind of the basics and um, let's get started. All right, so the first box that we are get, going to get into is the Allure Beauty Box. Um, now this is actually the last box that I was waiting on before I did this video. Some of these boxes um, or bags um, I've had for I would say like two to three weeks so I've been hoarding them a little bit but this is the June Allure Beauty box. So when you open it this is what you see. So you have your little booklet here and when you open the book it does give you a description of all the products that are in the box. So after you take that off, you have this here. So um, the Allure Beauty Box does cost $15 a month um, and it comes with at least five deluxe size sample products. You can also get full size products, but they do guarantee that you will get at least five deluxe size sample products in each box. Um, and like I said, this is a monthly subscription box. So the first product that I see, this definitely looks like a full size product, is the Pore Lease Watermelon and Charcoal Purifying Cleanser. Gently cleanses skin, gently cleanses skin, removes makeup, purifies, and energizes. So I am happy to get that product because I like to try new cleansers and I love watermelon. So when you take it out, that's what it looks like. And it is large. Oh, that does smell really good. Definitely, I can smell the watermelon. So this does have an $18 value. Um, and if you do go to uh, purelease.com and you enter Allure Cleanser, you can get a 20% off um, discount on that. So. That's right there. Um, the next product that I got is Belief. Um, it's from Belief. It's the True Cream Aqua Bomb Aloe Vera Soothing and Hydrating Aloe Complex. So there's that. Um, this looks like a sample size. This is 10 milliliters or 0.33 fluid ounces. So that's what the inside looks like. A little greenish kind of color. This is for your hair. I wasn't actually really sure what this was, but it is for your hair. It says that a full size of this would cost $38. So there's that. I don't know how far it would go if it's for your hair because it does seem like a pretty small canister. So, but I will try it out. The next thing is from Yenza Super 8 Lip Oil. So. I do like lip oils. They, it's a tinted lip oil, gorgeous even color, leaves lips with a killer shine, graceful aging lip nourisher, lightweight non-sticky texture, texture, delivers antioxidants with superfoods. So um, I do like lip oil because usually, oh, that's pretty. And it probably generally I find with lip oils, they're not quite, they seem very pigmented right here, but then when you take it out, it's not as pigmented. So 
you can kind of tell that it's not going to be as pigmented on. So there is that. And this does definitely look like a full size product as well because that is pretty large. And the value on that is $28. Okay. And the next thing that I'm seeing is a gold black pearl eye mask. Um, this advanced concentrated essence helps improve firmness, smooth fine lines, reduce puffiness and diminish dark circles for brighter and more youthful looking eyes. I am all about that because I definitely get very dark circles under my eyes, even with makeup on. I am sure you guys can see that. So this is just a sample of it. If you were to buy the full size where you would get 60 patches in one tub, that would cost you $60. So pretty pricey. I think in here you're getting just one pair. So there is that. The next thing, oh, I like this. Uh, these are the strips, the nail. Um, I'll just show you guys. <laughs> these are those nail sticker strip things. What's the name for them? I'm, I'm drawing a blank here. I have actually never tried these, and I've been wanting to. So I am certainly going to try these. And I think they're really pretty, too. So... Wears just like salon gel, lasts up to 40, 14 days. There's 34 strips, the nail file, and the instructions are enclosed. So, gives you the instructions on the back. This is from Dashing Diva, and the value on this is $9. And the very last thing in our box is a, a two-step oil sheet mask. So to save time, I'm not going to go all into, I don't know really know what the, I guess it's a sheet mask and then also this little oil capsule you would use somehow. The instructions are on the back on how to use that. And that is a price of $10. So I always like a nice sheet mask. So I will get use out of this as well. Overall, I am super happy with the Allure beauty box. Really, I'm very impressed and I will use every single thing in there. The only thing that I don't, that I'm not super crazy about was this, but um, I will try it out. I just don't love, it's a very little sample and I have a lot of hair. So moving on to box number two, we are, and I'm sure you guys have all heard of this, Ipsy. So with Ipsy, the cost of that is $12 a month for the regular glam bag, which is what I got. Um, there are, you can get the Ipsy Ultimate glam bag and then the Ipsy Plus, and those cost more money, but you get more products. I only got the regular Ipsy, and this is um, $12 a month. With this, you get um, five deluxe sample size products in it, along with a makeup bag every single month. So. This is an adorable, I really like this makeup bag. This is cute. It's got the little tab right there that says Ipsy. So let's get in and see what we have. They have a card that says, now I think that you can customize um, something in your bag every month. Yeah, it says choose a product. Near the end of each month, look out for a choice day email around the 20th. Pick one of the five beauty products in your next bag. Um, I, this is, I don't know if it's because it's my first bag. I didn't get a choice product, but, um, this is the little card that they give you in the bag. So what did we get? Okay. The first thing is from Benefit. It is a mascara Benefit Roller Lash. They don't give you any type of the, this card that they give you doesn't give you, uh, a, a, like a product guide or anything like that. So I don't know the value or like a description on any of these products. But this is the little mascara that they've included. It's definitely a sample size of it. I don't know how much use you're gonna get out of it. But I will try it. I do like that sort of um, brush at the end of that mascara. 
So that's a Benefit Roller Lash Mascara, black in black. Okay, the next thing that we got is a Jeju Gen. <laughs> I'm probably, somebody correct me um, if I'm saying that wrong. An aloe gel sleeping mask. And this is a 0.34 fluid ounce or 10 milliliter uh, container. This aloe gel sleeping mask contains aloe vera, vera extract and minerals from the Jeju Sea water that helps moisturize and nourish dry skin. So that has a little, little tab on it that I'm not gonna take off. So that was the second product I got. The third thing that I got, this may be full-sized. Um, this is a in, insanely intense tattooed water proof eyeliner from Schoon. So there's that, an eyeliner. I could always use a, and this is in jet black, and that's pretty much, I don't use crazy fancy colors on eyeliner. I usually stick to black. So I will get use out of this. I like that product. I have a lot of eyeliner, but. Okay, the next product I got was creme de la creme, the very best cream. So what is this? This is a luxurious body cream formulated with Canadian botanicals. So there's that. I don't know, it doesn't really smell like much of anything. But maybe if I put it on, it would smell more of something, but just smelling it, I don't. I do have perfume on though, so maybe that's kind of overpowering it. But it's probably a very subtle scent because I'm not smelling much of anything. But that's by Celia, Cella, Celia? I don't know, there's that. And the final thing that I got was Glow for a Cause Lip Love, which looks like a lip balm. And it would probably take me forever to, oh, maybe not. That has a nice little scent to it, it's pink color. I don't think it really has a ingredients, coconut oil, sunflower oil, beeswax, cocoa butter, shea butter. So it seems like it's a it's good natural ingredients in that. So this is full size lip balm. So those are the products I got in the Ipsy bag. Okay, along with the actual makeup bag. So I was pretty happy with that for twelve dollars a month. I think that's a pretty good deal. So I probably will. I don't know if I'll continue to get that subscription. I don't know. Do you guys get the Ipsy? I know that's a very popular subscription bag. I love the Allure one. The Ipsy one was just like, eh, the products are really small. So do you guys get that? What do you, what do you think of the Ipsy bags? So on the fence with that one. Um, moving on, number three. The next one I got was Splendies. So this is a monthly underwear subscription bag. Um, this one costs $14.99 a month. They do have a promotion for 50% off of your first bag. Now any promotion, any promo codes that I have, I will put a link down below for that. So you should be able to get 50% off of your first bag. Um, and you can choose between regular panties, thongs, or a combination of the two. They have sizes from small all the way up to 4X. So a large variety of sizes for anyone. Uh, so I got medium size and I'm excited to see what's in here because um, I like to get new panties, but <laughs> hopefully they're the right size. I generally do wear mediums, so hopefully it's they're true to size. I think they say to go up in size or down, I don't know. I just went with the right size, so hopefully they are correct. But they come in tissue paper like this. So let's open them up. I get, I just got regular panties. Did I already tell you guys that? I'm not a, I'm not a thong wearer. Maybe back 10 years ago, <laughs> but no more. They are just too uncomfortable for me. And I'm, I'm all about comfort, I'll tell you that much. So, oh man, they are really soft. This was the first pair that I got. I guess they have kind of, I don't know, a flowers or some sort of flower design and like a little lace trim. But they are really, I know you guys can't feel them, but they are super soft. I love that. Very comfortable feeling. 
Number two, that's a very pretty like purple periwinkle-ish kind of color with the same lace trim around and they have that same really soft, comfortable material um, and really stretchy as well. So that's a good thing. And they look like they fit. And this one doesn't have the lace trim around it, which is fine. And there is, is these. So I like them. I, I um, obviously will have to wear them, try them on, see if they fit and they're as comfortable as they feel. But if so, I don't think that's that bad of a price. They turn out to be about $5 a pair. So I like that subscription. And especially if you try it out, just trying it out for the first time, I guess you pay, I paid about $7.50 for, for the first one. So I don't know. I like it. So moving along to the fourth one I have is food. Who doesn't love food and snacks? This is Snack Nation. Um, this was the least expensive of the subscription boxes. Technically, you pay uh, just a dollar plus $3.99 in shipping. So it comes out to be $4.99 a month and they send you six snacks. Now the catch is you do have to fill out a survey. After you try the snacks, you fill out the survey. The survey only takes a couple of minutes from what I hear, I haven't actually completed the survey because I haven't eaten the snacks yet. They want you to eat them and try them out first before you complete the survey. They do give you a time frame to complete the survey by. Um, if you don't complete the survey, then you will be charged $9.99 for the box instead of the $4.99. So make sure you complete the survey. But otherwise, I think that's a pretty good deal to try out um, new and interesting snacks for just $4.99 a month. So I think you get your money's worth on that. So when you open your box, this is what it looks like. You get this um, little card in there and they actually, oh, okay, they put, so they do put it on there. It says complete your survey by the 25th. Um, so let's see what goodies we got this month. All right, the first thing we got was gluten-free granola and this is by Bakery on Main. Um, and it doesn't expire until November 26, 2020. So that's good. It's not expired. <laughs> that wouldn't be good if we got a bunch of expired food. <laughs> but uh, this is a cranberry almond maple flavor. Multi, multi grain and bean crisps with sweetened dried cranberry, sunflower seeds, almond, flax, and sesame seeds, and maple syrup. Oh, that sounds, that sounds pretty yummy. So... I like, uh, I like granola. So I, I think that sounds pretty good. That is the first one. The next thing we got was Peanut Puffs Original by Mighty. So these are um, made with just four ingredients, just made with just four ingredients. They are peanuts, corn grits, soybean oil, Himalayan pink salt. So, that looks pretty good. I love peanut butter. So, if you put peanut butter in any, like, any type of a snack, I will probably enjoy it. The next thing that's included are ZZ's Blueberry Lemon Soft Baked Bar. Ooh, that sounds really good. I like, I love fruity kind of stuff too. I guess I just, pro I pretty much like most snacks. <laughs> so, that's probably why I really like this box baked with whole grain and nut free that's another thing too they do focus on more health conscious snacks too they're not going to send you a bunch of unhealthy stuff so that the next thing is gluten-free roasted and salted peanuts by cars and they come in a little little thing like that you can't really go wrong with peanuts because most people like peanuts i get well if you have a peanut allergy i guess that's not a good thing and you can't, I don't, I don't believe you can customize this, these snacks. So if you do have a peanut allergy, maybe this isn't the greatest subscription box for you. Ooh, I am so excited about this. This is a Stroop waffle. I hope I'm pronouncing that correctly. This is one of the things, I haven't tried anything else so far, but I have. I love, love these. You can get these at Wawa. I, 
I don't know if, maybe not all of you have heard of Wawa. There's that fly again. What is with this fly? It was, it was here in the last video. Um, I, these are so delicious. They're soft toasted waffle filled with caramel, cinnamon, and real bourbon vanilla. And this is the caramel flavored one. They have different flavors. But if you have not tried these, you, you have to. <laughs> they are so good. I, I eat these all the time. Anyway, moving along. So good. The, the last thing in the box is by Sheffa. It's a coconut dark chocolate granola bar. I am not a huge fan of dark chocolate. I don't know that I'll eat that. I love coconut. I, I don't know. I, I do really like coconut. I'm not a huge fan of dark chocolate. So maybe I will like it. I'll definitely give it a try. And if not, I have a couple other people in my house who will more than likely love it. So I don't think any of these snacks will go to waste. This is certainly a subscription box. I will keep going because for $4.99 a month and a few minutes of my time to complete a survey, it is certainly worth it to me. Um, now, the next box, number five, is Face Tree. And this is a monthly sheet mask subscription box. Um, you get for, this is a weird amount, $8.90, you get at least four sheet masks in the box. And this particular one is called For Forever Fresh. So they do have different levels and you can choose different things. Well, for a lot of these different uh, subscriptions, there are different levels. I know with Snack Nation, the one I just showed you, you can get all different levels of snack boxes. You can get up to a ton of different snacks delivered to you obviously for more money but this one of course I went with the, the cheapest one in most of these so when you take it out this is what you get the sheet masks and they do give you a sheet here which looks like it explains the different masks um, along with the prices of them so let's see the very first one that we got now these are all Korean sheet masks so the first one that we got is Cocktail Cinderella. That, I know that drink looks, <laughs> if the sheet mask is anything like what that drink looks like, pineapples, oranges, mm, I'm in. I'm definitely in. This is from Pooh Claire. This sheet, masks help, this sheet mask helps hydrate tired and overworked skin. Say goodbye to dullness and show off your new glow with this extra nourishing mask. So it says it's packed with vitamin C um, and it feels extra relaxing after a long day. We love popping this in the fridge to amp up the experience. So you can put it in the fridge first and then you probably have a better experience. So that's the first one. It says this is worth $2 US dollars. Then the next one that we have is a from Bling Pop. A cucumber hydrating and brightening mask I love all the fun colors on all these so this one what does it have to say about this in need of a quick pick-me-up look no further this sheet mask is infused with cucumber extract for that lovely spa like vibe and that one is worth two dollars and fifty cents so the next one that we have is let's see the aloe this is by Jan Blanc, the aloe essential sheet mask. That's like a very spa-like vibe on that one. Um, this mask contains some of the best calming ingredients like um, centel asiatica, chamomile, and green tea. Need we say more? This is definitely one of our go-to masks whenever our skin needs extra love. And that has a value of $2. So the next one, they actually put a bonus mask in here. So I got five instead of four. That's pretty neat. Uh, the next one that we got is a is the Farm Stay Real Peach Essence Mask, a revitalizing sheet mask that helps moisturize the skin and provides extra protection for the skin's precious moisture barrier. And that looks delicious. This is I like we got the cucumber, we got the uh, 
the pineapple, the orange, very fruity kind of mixture here. Great for, for definitely reminds me of, of summertime. And then our bonus mystery mask right here. Keep cool and ocean mask. And it just says bonus mystery mask. Surprise, we included an extra mask in your, sub in your subscription just for our Facetory fam. So it doesn't give any more details about that, that particular mask. Um, and then as you can see, you're not, some of, some of it is, on, is in English on the back, but a lot of it is not. So I don't know how much detail you're gonna get by reading any of the back of these. So it gives you some tips on the bottom saying, do not leave masks on for over 30 minutes. Use the remaining essence to moisturize the neck and shoulders. That's a good tip. And apply a moisturizer after masking to lock in the essence from the mask. So that was a nice little uh, subscription right there. So four masks and they included an extra. So actually five masks for $8.90. So not bad, you get at least one a week. And I love the way my skin feels after using a sheet mask. So I'll get use out of that. Now the next two, I'll say, now I did a, a previous video, which I'll link down below. So I'm definitely not go, gonna go into a lot of detail at all about these two, because I these two I already unboxed and did a, a video on, a comparison video on, was scent, um, scent box and scent bird. So I'm going to include these in there because these are both under $15. Both of them are $14.95 a month. So they are both perfume subscription boxes. Um, both of them currently are running some sort of a discount. I feel like they change a lot, but I know they are running some, some sort of a discount, which I will link down below. I don't know exactly what they are right now. But um, when you do open the bag, this is your scent box subscription. Um, now scent box, like I said, is $14.95 a month and you can choose over 850 designer fragrances and they will send you a different fragrance. You choose which one you want and they will send you a different one every single month. They send it to you in this cute little metal canister right here. So the fragrance that I cho chose was Viva La Juicy and you just flip it up here and then you spray the fragrance out and you can take the little canister out. That's kind of how you can see. You can see I've been using it a little bit. So that's how much I have left. And it each perfume, I think I forgot to mention this in my other video, but each of these has um, about 120 sprays. So that equals out to about four sprays a day. So they're both pretty equivalent. As far as as far as that goes but I like I like this subscription service because it gives you the opportunity to try out a perfume before you commit to buying an entire bottle of it and then figuring out like you don't like it so you get to try before you buy and like I and they do have a very wide variety of fragrances so just like scent box there is kind of like its competitor scent bird and their perfume comes in a little pouch. Um, and when you take it out of the pouch, it's the same sort of atomizer. You open it up like that. Now with their fragrance, they don't put the fragrance name on the bottom like that. They'll put the fragrance name on the inside. Now each time scent bird will, uh, will give you the, your new scent every month, they will only send you this metal or this glass insert so that's why they put the name here um scent box will send you this entire metal canister every single month i think scent bird will only send you the, a new canister every three months so the fragrance that i chose was aqualina um it's okay aqualina didn't really do it for me so much um with scent bird you cannot exchange or return your fragrances. Um, scent box, you can return your fragrances. So that is one of those differences. Like I said, I'll link the video below for the two because I did go into a more in-depth um, review of both of these services. With Scentbird, they do include this 
little pamphlet here on how to use the atomizer. And they also included a card with your chosen fragrance along with all the different notes of that fragrance. That was Scent Box and Scent Bird. Um, scent Box. I know I'm kind of flip-flopping back and forth. I'm sorry about that. But Scent Box, I forgot to show you what's included inside the bag. They give you a coupon for 15% off any full-size fragrance that you choose to buy with them. And they give you the card just explaining that they offer the free exchanges. And this is the, um, they give you a piece of paper here that just is basically an invoice of your purchase, the scent that you did purchase. So that was number seven, no, number six and number seven. And we have one more left. <laughs> and our very last one, which I'm really excited about because I love makeup and beauty products and one of the things that I'm always most excited to, to get whenever I get a beauty subscription box is lip products. I just love trying different lip products, lip balms, lip glosses, you name it, I like to try it. So this next one that I got was Lip Monthly. Now it doesn't come, the actual bag is nothing fancy, but let's see what's inside. We got a little purple pouch along with a little insert here. And then it looks like it's an overview of the products that are included in the bag. I'll start by saying that Lip Monthly costs $12.95 a month. And with that, you get at least four full size lip products. And like that could include lip balms, lip glosses, lipsticks, lip liners, you name it, anything could be included involving the lips in that. And they also send you a a bag. Now, I didn't know, I, th it, I thought it was more like a makeup bag than like a pouch, but it looks like they're explaining that on here. Um, they said, just one thing, we apologize for the bags this month. We've been waiting on our branded canvas bags to arrive and there were some delays due to the ongoing situation. Rest assured, next month you will receive the normal lit monthly bags. So I guess with the current situation, they had an issue with their shipments and that's why they're sending it in this instead of the normal little like zipper pouches that you normally get, which is no big deal. I care more about the lip products than the bag, so that's not a problem. Um, for Now they have a great promotion going, so for the first month of this bag, you can get it for only $5, so that's awesome. So for all the products in this bag, it was only $5. So let's see what we got. The first thing is Cargo from Cargo Cosmetics. It is an essential lip gloss. Can you see the, I know there's a glare there, Cargo Cosmetics. Um, and this looks like, I guess this is the color, uh, Stockholm. Stockholm, I think is the color. That's a really pretty color. That's nice, that's a light pink kind of color. I specifically did this one last because I plan on putting the colors <laughs> like on my on my arm or my hand and I don't want to be I didn't want to have them on my hand the entire rest of the video so all right so that is what that looks like so that's pretty that's like a nice light pink I like that a lot so that's the first one I really like that one um did they give a price okay so they said that the retail price on that is although it's a little confusing with the the this insert that they gave me it says cargo cosmetics lipstick which this isn't a lipstick unless I got something else here from cargo cosmetics but anyway they said cargo cosmetics lipstick $22 so this isn't a lipstick it's a gloss but maybe it's still worth $22 I'm not sure okay the next thing we got is from Steve Laurent which of course I heard from heard about him and that is in the color ballerina so there is that and this is what that looks like and that looks like a pretty pinkish kind of color as well not quite as pink as the last one 
but more of maybe like a neutral kind of shade. Okay. And there is that one. This is like an awkward position. So that one is also a nice color. The value on that one is also $22. Then the next thing I got is by Man oh, Manica Dar. And this is a, this is actually a lip, <laughs> I thought that this would be a lip liner since this is a lip bag, but it's not. This is a You Complete Me retractable eye liner in jet black. So I guess they send eye line, they, they're, they're, they're sending not just lip products all the time, but it seems like I got five things in the bag. So maybe this was just like an added bonus. So I'm not mad about that. That is a, um, a good company. So I'm kind of happy about that. Yeah, definitely, definitely an eyeliner in black. So, okay, well that's cool. It seems like I've got an extra product in there because I have two more things in here to look at. The next thing I got is from Appeal and this is an ultra cream lipstick. Does it give me the color in fancy? Looks like that it's called, it's in fancy. And there is no value on this one. So this is what this one looks like. This is also like a pinkish type color. Okay. So this is what that looks like. I feel like I can't, it's like an awkward position. <laughs> so there's that. That one's not bad. Not my favorite. I, I'll probably wear it sometimes. I don't like it as much as I like the glosses. But it's still nice. All right, then we are on to our final thing, which looks like it is a lip balm by Portland B. So it's a Portland B balm in Oregon mint. So I like that. It looks like it's a like a mint flavored kind of balm. Oh yeah. Oh, that smells very minty. I love that. That smells really good. And that has a retail value of $6. So this is all the stuff we got in the lip monthly, which I only paid th th this month, I only paid $5 for. So for $5, that was an awesome value. And next month they'll be charging me $12.95 and I will get um, at least four full size lip products. So that is a pretty good value. I will probably continue that subscription and see where it goes. I don't know how many lip products I could possibly use, especially because I do get other beauty subscriptions. So I might not keep it going like forever, but I will keep it going probably at least for a couple more months. I did really enjoy that subscription box. So let me know what you guys thought of all these budget friendly subscription boxes. What was your favorites? Do you guys subscribe to any of these boxes? What do you think? Or do you have any budget friendly boxes that you subscribe to? I had a couple other in mind that I was gonna get um, and then I just, I didn't, I chose these. So let me know if there's any other budget friendly boxes that you guys subscribe to that you really love. I'd love to hear your thoughts on this and on others. So I'd love to hear your comments down below. Like I said, I will link any discount codes that I have down below and please like, comment and subscribe and I will see you guys next time. Bye.